Thank you so much for joining me. This is Game Edge. We are back in Rising World, finally. Yes, all right, so we have our, our stuff here that's uh, being built, as you can see. Here we go. We have our ingots in here from last time we left, and it's still burning up. It's doing a good job. Uh, we're actually going to start building over here. Hopefully, it's not too dark for you guys. I know I can turn on a light here and make it a little easier. We'll just, just for now, until we're building. Unfortunately, it's just, uh, it gets a little dark for the videos. You know I'm saying? So, let's just get that done. Hold this down with left click, and then after we're going to be heading out right away to get some exploration and coal done too. That's the other thing that so we have to look at. We'll have some gaps here and a lot, uh, just in case they have to leave a gap for one of these. We could always make a door. Some people say make a door here, and you can go back and forth and actually access it. So it's not a bad idea. That's actually a good idea in case you guys get stuck and you didn't want to, you know, got to find a way to build around it. You can always do that. Luckily enough, uh, we placed it and there's still access to it. So I'm very happy with it right now. It goes up really nice, doesn't it? Oh, man. I don't think I'm already out. I need more rock, too. Mm. Okay, we need a chest, too, at the same time. Let's turn off this light. We're about to get bright. There we go. Uh, I'm going to need a chest built for the nair. Uh, let's see. What looks nice? Old chest. Near furnace. I don't like that shape at all. The barrel of main usages, objects, and storage items. Hmm. Some barrels next to it would be pretty cool. Actually, it'll look kind of... I like that idea, actually. Let's craft two of those. And uh, we're going to pick this up, too. We'll bring the anvil in here, which would make more sense. And after that, we won't be using light afterwards. Don't worry. It's just for temporary. So we'll put one here. Hold that down. And one on the other side. How about one in and out? That'd be pretty cool, actually. Oh, wait. Does that does it connect still access this? I don't think I can. Okay, no. Off you go. Come back to me. Tell me I can pick this up, right? Yeah. Cool. Very few things you can't pick up. I know you can't pick up this thing, but I just like to have one here. On each side. There we go. We'll bring this one a little further out. Just to make sure to make myself feel better that doesn't look so bad. And we'll have that one right about here. There we go. So in would be something like this, where we put in a stuff that we need to burn up here. Uh, iron ore. Shift click that. There we go. Beautiful. Each one of these are different kind of rocks. Just right click. So I'm actually, to do this, I know some people have been asking me about that in the comments field too. Um, what I'm doing here is actually spreading them out and then I'm holding left click. So I hold the left click down on the mouse and then I hit the right click. So the first one you can't get, but you can get the rest of them. So it's just in case we actually start, you know, we want to take this part. It makes it a lot easier when you want to store away and do a shift click. That way they go exactly the same spot. Same thing I use in Seven Days to Die. And actually something I think I've got from Pam or uh, from Cage. So stone here, we actually need that. That's cool. Uh, these are things that came out. Tugs of iron and stuff. We can put that over here. All these are ready to go too. Wow. All right. We'll keep the flame going just to get some light. Extra light. You shouldn't do this in real life uh, with heat. <laughs> it's pretty bad. But again, it's pretty cool to actually be able to pull it down. This furnace is absolutely insane. There we go. Oh man, it's so cool. It's fun to put them down too. I kind of like the sound of it. it. Looks really nice. Hopefully daylight can come up very shortly so we can get the rest of our stuff done. I like these barrels actually quite a lot. I'm running out of space because that's gone into my number five slot so I can see it right now. And we'll just go in here. And there we go. What is this, iron? Okay. There we go, just go across here. Boom. And then we just shift click into here. In theory, yes. There we go, shift click back in. And then we also put in what, we have copper. Beautiful. Now that will be able to fill all these up, but it's just temporarily having them down. That's pretty cool. Uh, we also have some iron plates here. And we also want to put this down afterwards. 
and tungsten. All right, cool. I don't think we have that much anyway, so we'll leave, leave like that. Tungsten is pretty rare to find. Well, at least level I'm at, you'd most likely down lower levels, you'll probably be able to find some. We have 20 weight bars there. This is good. So at least if we're separating stuff, we're storing it properly, it'd be a lot easier for us to find. Uh, the wooden stuff, we're going to bring back on your side, but I'm going to put the anvil over here. Can I rotate this, please? Yeah, with the arrows. Okay. Actually, you know what? Didn't look so bad there. Let's put it in like an angle in a corner. Like right here for now. Just for now. Beautiful. Everything's going to come together here. This is actually our two workrooms. That's what we really want. And it's actually starting to come together. This is actually our greenhouse if you haven't seen it before. It looks pretty sweet. Oh yeah, turn off the light. Too bright, too bright. And put back our supplies in here too. Um, so many supplies. Oh, I have... What are you guys doing here? What's this? Sandstone. Okay. We'll put the supplies in here. There we go. I don't know why it does bound like that. Sometimes it gets stuck. The shift click isn't perfect. Um, I'm aware of it, but uh, it's okay. Daylight's coming. I can hear the birds coming. It's starting to come in. <laughs> I can hear the birds coming. I hear the birds singing, and that's a very good news. It's the right one? It is the right one. Cool. We'll put up a little bit. What do we have left here? Let's utilize the stock we have. Beautiful. I think to finalize the top part would be pretty cool. But I don't think I have the height for it. It's so tough to do. I'm going to have to put some scaffolding or, or at least climb up on there. It's all good. Daylight's here. We're going to be going to get some supplies. All right. That's cool. Put the sandstone in here. Why not? We can do it in uh Well, oh, there's no note. Oh, so these ones, these barrels don't have a secondary slot. Ooh, okay. So the bigger chests have the secondary slots. So you're really limited with, well, not lim really limited, but you're limited. There we go. All the blocks are done. I'm going to put that, take away light and take away the stuff we don't need here. This can go back. And this is cherry wood that can go back too. And that has to go over there. Oh my God, I have so many blocks left. What was I complaining about? Ooh. Anyways, we got to get out there and gain some coal to, to our furnace. We'll turn off our furnace here or did it just die off with no lumbar? Yeah, it's out. Out of fuel. All right, I think we saw some over there. At the same time, we'll just take a little exploration. It should kind of... we have enough water on us? I'm pretty sure we do. We have watermelon too on us though. That's pretty good. Watermelon will give us, of course, water. Makes sense. Watermelon. <laughs> we do have our pickaxe. We actually have no weapons, but I don't think there's anything here except for bears. I don't I haven't encountered one, only them far away. But uh, I think we, we should be okay. Let's go around this corner here and see if there's anything. Oh, shit. That's a big-ass pig. Man, I thought you were a bear, pig. There's some cows. All right. Should be able to. Oh, well, we won't say no to this. Let's get the tomatoes. This will be handy to have. We've got a bear on a right that's on a mountain, kind of floating. What do we have here? I am looking for coal, though. I want the black stuff, not this stuff, but this is interesting. What are we grabbing here? We got rock. Dirt. Tungsten ore. Okay. Like dirt. Alright, that's cool. We got a little bit of tungsten out of this. Looks like there's a little cave that's going in here. I didn't bring any torches and stuff, so. Can't really utilize that. That's pretty stupid of me, actually. But it's okay. That's still pretty good. We'll be able to drop the dirt over there, anyways. It's not a big deal. It's good to carry. That's how I built that, that mound over there. It takes quite a bit of time. And I was told about still to use a site for actually. Um, sickle, sorry, for actually putting on grass. I'd like to test it out, too. Okay, we'll come back for some more of this. I'll see it right away. I just want to investigate a little further. Gotta be careful that bear on the right. I did not bring any weapons with us, so 
We got goat. All right. And I didn't bring an axe either. Okay. Well, so be it. Just gonna drop one of these down here and just press five because it really is annoying to watch. Okay, this is snow biome. I thought I saw some. Oh, let's take a sip here. Some more water. I thought I saw some coal back here, but I guess maybe I missed it. Our way back here. Wait, what's that? Got a little bit of cave here. We got some more. All right. This could be copper, I think. Yeah, it's copper. Sweet. So we actually got quite a bit of stuff here. All things we actually need to get in the smelter anyways. Tungsten too is actually really handy. We'll be building with all these things afterwards. I'd just like to get as much melted as possible so we can get into building a little more. We actually have the materials. And it's good to get out here sometimes and actually do a bit of the game like this. We actually get to see how it feels and works. There's some black stuff there. That's good. That's what we're going for. Is that some here too? Looks a little dark and usual, isn't it? I do need rock anyways for... No. What the hell is that? A little late on reaction, but did you guys hear that? It sounded like a gunshot. Maybe it's a rock or something falling down. We'll grab whatever we can out of this sucker. And then we'll go down and, and get the, finally the coal that I saw down below. Hope there's no bears on there too. That would suck really badly. Again, this game is really impressive. The developers are really working hard at it. It's the sound of these rocks or something. That's what it is. Okay, let's dig our way through. What the hell is this? Kind of be cool if they actually told us what the hell we're picking up. But it's okay. I mean, it can't be all perfect. There we go. Let's break on through to the other side. There we go, come on. I'll be able to dig my way back up, I hope so. Now the black stuff is supposed to be coal. I think it's, it's mixture. I'm kind of thrown off by what the hell that is. Stone, stone, ore, iron. I don't see anything else here. Tungsten. I thought that was, damn it. I thought that was coal. Looks like we just got a lot of copper coming through here. 21. Let's just see. 23. Yeah. But was it black a little bit on top? That's strange. I mean, maybe it's a graphic issue. It's very possible. Maybe we'll dig down. I mean, we can do also maybe near the base we'll start digging and just trying to find something. Hopefully we'll get a... We'll have to make our own mine shaft and just start digging because we can't go out here all the time and start doing this. I think that might be a good idea. Building yourself a little tunnel and a mine shaft itself with the wood. Pretty cool, actually, if we can actually build that. I've never built one of those. Come on. I'll just pick it up now. How much is this? Is like really good deposit? If it is, then we'll have to come back. I think that's about it. So, I mean, I can't wait for the developers to actually add a hand to this thing. That will be pretty damn cool. I know a lot of you are... That's one thing that disappoints you, but don't be disappointed in this game. It has a lot of opportunity and a lot of things you can build with here. You know, it gives you like, tons of opportunity to, to expand your mind and to get building or whatever you feel like. And it is kind of very, I mean, relaxing actually doing this. To tell you the truth, kind of enjoy it. The mining part of it is actually really nice. Getting as much as we can out of resources. There we go. That's a black spot, isn't it? There we go. Well, we got coal after all. i just show you guys, the coal is like that dark, in case. I know you can't see it too well, but it really does 
There is a difference between both. This will actually feed the fire properly. I feel like when I see those pieces go down there, I feel like that we're gonna we're losing pieces. We can't pick them up. We can peer around to go pick them all up. Let's just double check. We should see what the book falls. Yeah, it's black pieces still. So we hit ourselves a nice little. Uh, I have to open it up to see here, because I didn't bring a torch. Even a torch, you can't tell the difference. That's one thing they actually they were talking about in the forums. If they could change that up and add something else, with all the stuff we can build here, I think they have a flashlight and stuff too. But better lighting. I think it's a lighting effect that doesn't work really well. That is something that uh, Seven Days to Die has been fighting on, fighting to work on for a while too. So how much do we get out of that? Twenty three. I hope that lasts a lot longer. Whoops. Oh, we're breaking through the. Oh. Breaking through to the other side. Okay, we have to get up here now. Guess what we're gonna do is just make ourselves some stairs. Just aim a little higher. There we go. I think we're okay. Oh, one more step. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, hopefully we won't. Uh, Mr. Bear is gonna stay where he has to. That would be appreciated. And hopefully we can actually head back. Now we actually got quite a bit of goodies. And right even here, there's still some goodies left, I'm pretty sure, that we can actually get back on to get later on. Oh, man, that's a lot of caves. I think the digging your own cave and trying to see what we can find in our own area, that would be pretty cool. Hopefully we can find our way back too, because I just kind of whimmed it out. I'm hoping it follow a straight line, but I don't remember all this frost here on the ground when I was running it. So I'm going to stay near the biome that's warmer and hopefully we can find our way back out here. Should be. Should actually start putting out torches. I know uh, Canon a lot for mentioning you guys put out torches and uh, stuff like that to actually keep track of where you guys are going. We'll probably have to start building a road and stuff. Uh, that style where you actually can see what we're doing. Because being lost like this is not cool. Like I'm doing right now. I have a feeling that I'll be walking around this thing for quite a bit of time looking for this. If we don't find it right around this corner. Oh, Jesus. You're just jumping around trying to see what I can see. Okay, I recognize nothing. Did I take this apart? It's easy to pass. All right, let me pause the video here. I'll find it. I'll be right back. All right, actually, surprisingly, that hole over there, I just take a couple more steps, and there we are. I wasn't lost completely. I just felt like I was because I didn't show up after a long period. So our health is good on the bottom left. Why does it show as if we got hurt? It looks like it popped, but maybe it's just me. I don't know. Very strange. Okay, so let's get back in here. Let's see what this coal can do. Um, let's put this in our hand. There we go. Let's open this up. And yeah, let's feed her up. Let's see now. 40, 80, 20. I think this is going up a whole lot faster than the wood. Yeah, it is, definitely. Let's get that in the furnace. 13 pieces left. All right. Okay, that's a pretty good start. We can close this up. And then we can pick up the pieces we just found right now. That's good. I'll put this on top. Well, we got a lot of copper, that's for sure. That's definitely handy. And we put some tungsten on the bottom, too. This is so sweet when you do this. I don't know what it is. It's so... <laughs> I don't know. The game is so cool. You have to do so many things to keep yourself alive and get going. Uh, from rock to all the stuff you think you're going to get. This is pretty much what I do sometimes off camera. This is where you keep on asking me, well, you know, how do I get all the rock and stuff. That's pretty much it. I go out and find some rocks and I find my way back home. There we go. This one is a whole lot easier than the other one. Holy crap. How many more left? Five. Four. Five. And then we'll put some iron, I guess. Or wait, where's the other one? Number one. Okay, let's put number one in. There you go. Start from the back to the front all the times. 
cool. And I just go up to a little piece of where it shows a fire. And I press F. Bam. We got our furnace going. How beautiful. That is amazing. Uh, we can actually place some of this stuff in here if we want to. Our stone, we're going to keep on us. We're going to need to build more blocks. There we go. This is iron, right? Uh, no, this is stone. This stone. No, it's not a big deal. Actually, maybe we'll keep the stone here too. Who cares? Just alleviate ourselves some crap that we have on us. Dirt, we don't need to have on there. That's okay. And we'll put the coal at the end here so we don't lose it. Beautiful. All right. So we're still pretty good on food and stuff. Yes. Number four. Let's make sure we're 100%. Man, watermelon looks delicious. Cool. All right. Let's get these things back up here. Let's get them rolling. Before the video ends here. Let's get this done. Maybe get a window here eh, somewhere. Maybe not there exactly. Unfortunately, the only way of doing it is just like some days die taking it off is doing it that way. Uh, maybe a window in the middle of this one because you can't do too much with a furnace there. So, I look in the middle. It does look like it's middle. Okay. Middle part, and I leave one, one, two here. It's the middle. Two here. All right. Beautiful. There we go. And we'll make sure there's nothing for the furnace. We're going to need that here. Maybe another window over here. Smaller one. For now. We're doing one slot there, just in case. This one, actually, you can maybe make a different style window if you want to. Let's make things look nice. But again, it's a work area, so it doesn't have to be perfect. Yeah, that makes work. That works for me. All right, cool. And again, I could add these windows afterwards, so it's not a big deal. It just takes a couple blocks off. It's not a big, big deal. How many more do we have left? We have a shitload left. All right, cool. Awesome. All right. I think I need to jump up on one of these things here. Just let me jump this far. It does. Most excellent. Let's see if we can seal the deal on this. Oops. Let's be walking glass. Awesome. Beautiful. Let me go across. Why is that? Oh, okay. I'm out. I thought I'd just switch over right away from me. So, okay. Yeah, that's good. Should I do it from here right here? There we go. There we go. Just trying to think how I can get this properly done. Let's move this over here. I'm debating, debating some stuff there. Just debating. Beautiful. I have to go in from the inside. Damn it! I'd like to get this done. How did I do that last time? I guess it's a glitch. Jump and then move. Oh, because I ran. Okay, so running works there too. All right, that's cool. <laughs> this is so crazy. Crazy but fun. Ah, oh, shit. I don't think I jumped that one, that's for sure. 
All right, so I'll leave the episode here. I'm gonna have to put out scaffolding, get everything else done. So again, we're gonna start getting this pretty much completed and built, which is sweet as hell. I'm so freaking happy. Again, we're gonna start looking at other parts of the game too. We have to start working on. Uh, there is definitely. I was hoping to make that. <laughs> There's definitely um, a little more building to do, and I like to get the other tier workbench going too. So this, I uh, maybe have two forges going would be pretty sweet. And then maybe go for a secondary, um, oh, let's make this place a little bit better and then start looking at building our house and also a mining tunnel. That's gonna be the main key, I think, because we have to build that mining tunnel. And if you wonder what I'm doing, I'm just trying to jump up this thing, but nope. Anyways, for some reason, the other side worked. It doesn't work here, scaffolding is needed. So be it. All right, guys, thank you so much for being here. This is The Edge from Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.